for the launch of uh, an innovative Western Bulldogs men's health program that has been titled the Sons of the West and which is based on the best practice men's health program in part run by EPL giant Liverpool FC in the UK and it's fantastic to be back here and see so many familiar faces on what is a great day for the Western Bulldogs Football Club. It's a real feel good feeling to be able to work together to produce something that we think will be of great community benefit like this men's health program. This program at its core is seeking to use something that most men love and want to be involved in. The power, the passion and the camaraderie of football to make a difference to the lives of those men living in our community, the western region of Melbourne. It's an innovative, free health program aimed at engaging up to 2,000 men across the west of Melbourne in simple, healthy activities aimed at boost boosting their health. No nonsense, easy to access activities aimed at improving awareness and general health levels. There is a terrific opportunity for individuals to stop putting off that walk around the block or swim at the local pool. What more motivation do you need but to get involved with this innovative and exciting program? I want to congratulate Peter Gordon, Simon Garlick and the Western Bulldogs for this initiative. Well, great uh, opportunity now for me to catch up with some old mates and I asked them all to make their way to the stage, the ambassadors uh, for this program, former uh, champions of the Bulldog Football Club. My role is the, uh, the mountain area. It's going to be a big job for me. Um, I'm going to get these guys to be a bit like a team. They're going to help each other. If a guy's got a, a drinking problem or a smoking problem, we're going to communicate and talk together as a group. And my role is to try and help these blokes get their lives better, fitter, healthier and back on track. Dar. So to be part of this program, I'm absolutely wrapped. I'm going to have a real good crack at it up at Melton. Uh, again, it's going to be a big challenge, but I'm looking forward to it, mate. It'll be great. Then. Look, I just enjoy getting out and about. I mean, I think, as, you, as Doug said, when you're a middle-aged man now, nowadays, you're a role model for your kids as well, which is really important. And I think um, it's a great program, and I'm really excited to get involved with it. Uh, look, I'm, I'm one of those blokes from the West. You know, I've lived in uh, Sydney most of my life and in Deer Park, so I'm a, I'm a Bring Bank resident. And, and I, I realise the faces that everyone, uh, the problems everyone faces. You know, it's, 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 it's hard to make the choice to eat a good meal when you're surrounded by, you know, dodgy options. It's, um, it's something that you actually have to step out of your comfort zone um, to do. And it's not really that confronting. It's just about making smarter choices, um, things that are a bit healthier. Um, and at the end of the day, like, like uh, the guy said before, you might drop a shirt size, you might live a bit longer, spend a bit of time with your kids, everybody wins. I think the hardest thing that I you know, see as a personal trainer is um, people taking that first step. Uh, even if it's a small one, um, that first step, which is normally the hardest, once they get involved and they start making those life, life, lifestyle changes, which might be something small, um, as Shane said, maybe a walk or take, uh, reducing something out of your diet, once you start seeing the changes, it actually starts to get quite addictive. All it takes is that first step and the first initial lapse that, um, that gets the ball rolling. And you know, the, the advantages are you feel healthier both physically and, and the most important thing is uh, the, you know, feeling better about yourself and, and mentally feeling better as well. Oh, it's great that we can engage with our community and actually contribute something back. Um, obviously, they give us an enormous amount of support within the, the Western region and for the footy club to be able to. I guess give something back to, to our, our community and it's a growing community and it's a, it's a really vibrant one. Um, you know, to give something back is, is fantastic for us. So let me say that if you are a man aged 18 or over who lives or works in the West and wants to improve their health, get along to the Sons of the West Expo at Victoria University Witten Oval on the 18th of May between 11 and 3 or sign up at our website www.sonsofthewest.org.au